Today I wanted to tell you a little bit about neurons. So neurons are nerve cells and they're what carry signals around our brain. Now the kinds of signals they send are actually electrical signals. And we know this because of the work of someone called Luigi Galvani. Now he was a scientist who lived about 150 years ago and he was experimenting on dead frogs, as was quite normal at the time. Um, and he found that if you put some electricity through this dead frog's leg, he could make it twitch. And he thought this was incredibly exciting. He thought he'd discovered something brand new. He called this animal electricity. And he thought this was what gave humans and animals life, what animated us, our life force. And if you see some parallels to the great literature here, you'd be right. Uh, this is exactly where Mary Shelley got the inspiration for her work, uh, Frankenstein, where a mad scientist sews body parts together, but then to bring the monster to life, he puts electricity through it, giving it this spark of life. We now know that actually animal electricity isn't anything special. It's exactly the same kind of electricity that lights up lights and charges our mobile phones. It's all to do with the flow of charged particles. And in our body, these tiny charged molecules flow in and out of our neurons, causing them to send signals along themselves. But Luigi Galvani was right. Our neurons and our nervous system do use electricity to communicate. And this is something that is still really, really important in understanding how the brain and the nervous system works today.